Turkey's been launching airstrikes around its borders, and now Turkey's president says he doesn't think it's possible to continue a peace process with those who take aim at Turkey's national security and brotherhood. Bernard Smith is covering the story. Here in Turkey's Kurdish-dominated southeast, there has long been frustration that the peace process between the PKK and the government has stalled. And now there's anger amongst many Kurds here that the Turkish government seems to be equating its fight against ISIL with its fight against the PKK. Twelve trade ministers from Pacific Rim countries are meeting in Hawaii. The media is not invited, but we're learning the ministers are trying to finalize the Trans-Pacific Partnership trade deal. Andrew Thomas explains why there's so much controversy around the TPP. Hawaii is the geographic heart of a huge region which, as the name of this deal suggests, is Trans-Pacific. Countries from South America to the north of Asia, the US, Canada, Australia too. Already they make up 40% of the world's economy. The hope is that a TPP deal will increase the size of all those economies. But the deal has its critics. People who say jobs will be lost, environmental standards will fall, and for the world's poorest, the price of medicines will rise. Every big competition or race loves to say it's the biggest, the hardest, or best. But this running race is pretty amazing. The winning time is around 24 hours. Gabriel Elizondo is there. Some people call it a race. Others say it's a run. Others say it's just survival. That is what most of the athletes will be facing is survival when they compete in the Badwater 135, a 135 mile or 217 kilometer foot race that starts here in the Death Valley National Park of California. As you might be able to tell, nothing really survives here because it is so hot. This is one of the hottest areas in the entire world, certainly in North America. All this and more on Al Jazeera.